Okay, so in this example, let's try to create structure wall material schedule. Uh, so for this task in Revit project, I will use architecture wall material schedule and I will make duplication. And let's rename this part. And let's make some changes to this schedule. So first I will uh, in insert some additional parameters uh, which describe structure materials. So it will be structural usage and structure materials. Uh, one of these parameters will be used in filtration. However, is not possible in here. So structural usage uh, does not equal uh, non-bearing. So it means if wall is mm, our category bearing shear or structural combined it will be in my schedules next part i want to filter only the structure material names from this walls so first i will check what will happen here so from here i see uh, program gives me only the bearing structure usage so i can hide this this parameter is working fine and from here i see a structure material should be just for this layer but it gives me for all the layers the same material so i will put some additional keynote elements uh, or i can put this uh, elements in the mark section so it both ways are correct if you correctly describe these objects in your uh, material schedule so let's say this will be structure material and i go to filtration and i select material keynote equals structure material and I press OK and program gives me only the materials which is described like structure materials so I hide this column and I have only structure materials in my schedule 